Hello folks, hope you're having a wonderful day, and let's not waste any time diving into today's topic. It is the Arizona Governor's Race of 2022 between Katie Hobbs and Carrie Lake. Media outlets have declared Katie Hobbs the winner, Carrie Lake has not conceded, and let's uh, talk about it a little bit. Now, as you know, as Secretary of State of the State of Arizona, Katie Hobbs is in charge of overseeing statewide elections. And Carrie Lake, as a challenger, what's been a month or two before the election, asked her to recuse herself from overseeing the election. She did not ask her to step down as Secretary of State because it was a question of ethics, overseeing the election that she was running for. And I could see that, but not only was it unethical, it's very possible she may have violated state law. And uh, I have the state statute that she may have violated. Now, to the liberals watching this that are going to start screaming, what's your source? Well, my source is ArizonaLegislature.gov. That is A-Z-L-E-G dot gov. So, without further ado, it is ARS 38-503, Section B. Any public office or employee who has or whose relative has a substantial interest in any decision of a public agency shall make known such interest in the official records of such public agency and shall refrain from participating in any manner as an officer or employee in such decision. Now, what that tells me is that Secretary Hobbs, by law, should recuse herself, should have recused herself from overseeing the governor's race that she was participating in. Now, I, to the best of my knowledge, don't live in Arizona, obviously from the name of this channel, Southwest Nebraska, but keep kind of keep up on this stuff. Candidate Hob, uh, excuse me, Candidate Lake just asked her for ethical reasons. I don't think she brought up this statute, but I believe she should. She has not recused herself. There have been is other issues, counting, uh, machine malfunctions, other stuff that just wasn't quite working. And for Secretary Hobbs, the video footage of her overseeing the ballots on Election Day, that doesn't look good either. So I, I really... For me, from the outside looking in and knowing about this statute now that I just read you, I think that, you know, a closer look needs to be happened. Um, anyway, just thought I would throw that out there, let everybody know that it, it was a state law that Secretary Hobbs allegedly broke, you know, innocent until proven guilty. But anyway... We'll see what happens. Um, thanks for watching the video. The channel's Chaos in Southwest Nebraska. Go ahead and subscribe. Like all the videos and really help us out. And we have a good evening and over and out.